In this tutorial, we will guide you on how to use the color key effect in Adobe Premiere Pro CS6. Color keying is a post-production technique for layering two images or video streams together based on their chroma range. The technique has been used heavily in many fields to remove a background from the subject of a photo or video. For this tutorial, you would need a video shot with a green or blue background and a virtual set for the background. First of all, go to the media library and drag the virtual set which you want to use as the backdrop. Transform the image according to the frame size and position it accordingly. Now drag the footage with the green screen background on the overlay track, resize it, and position it according to the background layer. Once done, go to the effects menu and apply the crop video effect on the green screen clip. This will allow removing the unwanted area of the clip and it makes it easy for you to apply the color key effect. Go to the effect control panel and crop the clip from both the right and left side. Now apply the auto contrast video effect on the same clip which will enhance the colors of the video. Once you are done, go to the effect menu again, move over to the folder named keying and apply the ultra key filter on the clip. Move over to the effect control panel and expand the ultra key menu. Click on the color picker from the key color option and select the background color to be removed. And there you have it, the background is completely removed from the clip. But if you look closely, you can still see some shades exist within the frame. Select the alpha channel from the output menu, and there you can see the background is still clearly visible. Now configure each of the following options. Set the pedestal to 100, midpoint to 50, highlight to 10, transparency to 37, shadow to 52, and tolerance to 20. Once done, switch to composite from the output menu and hit enter to render the whole sequence. Now you can view the final output.